Once upon a time, there was an elephant. He was very happy, friendly, and kind. He lived in the jungle, and his family said he was feeling that he didn't have friends who always together. His friend only came in his house when there was a party. Then he told to find the sincere friend in his life. In the midnight, he told how to find sincere friends. He woke up his mother and his father to a suggestion how to find the true friend. Mom, wake up, Mom. What happened, baby? Why did midnight you wake up us? I got a problem, Mom. I didn't have a friend. My friends come on in the party. So, do you want to find the true friends? All right. Oh, I see. What is it? You have to ask your friend one by one and ask. Do you want to be my friend? Yeah. And then, who can accept you very friendly? He is your friend. Well, I get it, father. Thank you, and I love you. I love you too. Have nice dream. Sorry for disturbing your time. All is well, baby. At the morning, many animals were flying in the jungle. The elephant come and asked them one by one. First, he asked a monkey, Hi monkey, hi elephant, do you want to be my friends? No, you are very big to jump and swing the trees like me. Then he went to a frog, and he asked to him the same question. Hi hey frog, how are you? Not bad. Do you have friends? Yes, my friend is only dead, Paul. Do you want to be my friends? Sorry, you are very big to jump and swing in the water like me. The eleven didn't give up. He was going to other place to find the true friends. On the way, he saw a rabbit that looking for a carrot. He came to a rabbit and he asked to him, Oh, eleven, why you go there? Any party in your house? There is no party, rabbit. I want to ask you, do you want to be my friends? No. You cannot dig how like me and find carrot to eat. The elephant was very sad because no animal wanted to be his friend. Then he came back in his house and told his parents that no animal can be his friend. But his parents gave a suggestion to shred again in the next day. In the next morning, he was going to jungle. There were many animals went to a place. He found a beautiful bird in branch. He asked her, Hello, bird. Good morning. Oh, morning. Do you want to be my friend? No, eleven. You don't have wings to fly like me. Oh, thank you. The eleven came to wet egret, and he asked him, Hi, wet egret. Might I to be your friends? No, I think you cannot to be my friends because you are so big to find fish in the light like with me. Oh, I see. Then the eleven was going to a mouse and he asked the same question. Mouse? Oh, the eleven. Hello, mouse. Do you wanna to fly with me? Oh, sorry, eleven. I want to go with lion. Okay, yeah, I see. Are you looking for my friends? Yeah, do you want to be my friends? Are you seriously? Yes, I'm seriously. Sorry, you cannot brag like me and you are so big to be my friends. Oh, okay, no problem. Then he saw the ant who climbed it in the branch. Hi ant, do you want to be my friend? Why you ask about it? Nothing. So? No eleven. I think you are so big, I'm scared if you disturbing my house. The elephant have good idea to find best friend. He gave an announcement to them there will be a party in his house tonight. He planned to invite them to his house. Who has angry because the party don't have a food? He is not his best friend. And who is not angry, it is his friend. Then many animals were happy about it. And many animals wanted to be his friend. Hi, friends! Come there! It is announcement!
said the elephant. No, man, said the bird. Today there is a party in my house because today is my birthday. Please come to my party, said the elephant. Really? said the rabbit. Wow, fantastic, said the frog. I want to be your friend, elephant, said the monkey. I will cancel my promise with lion, said the mouse. I want to be your friend, guy, said the duck. Okay, don't be late, said the elephant. The elephant was going to the home. Then, in a home, he was telling his parents about his plan to find a sanctuary friend, and the parent was gay. I know it. Many animals went to the party. Many animals were angry and they were feeling led by the elephant. But one of them was different. He was conscious. Our mouse dear. He brought many food and he brought to eleven. Hi elephant, happy birthday! I hear that today is your birthday. So I bring many food. I think you like it. Thank you, mouse. You are my true friends. Really? Why? Yeah, look that. Many animals are angry and got away from here because the party don't have a food to eat. So, today is not your birthday? Yes, that's true. I want to be know who is my friends. Oh, Eleven, I want to be your friends. Finally, the Eleven found the true friends. He and the mouse deer were always together and they were good friends. Mouse deer can accept the weakness of the eleven and the eleven can accept the weakness of the mouse deer. The moral value of the story is don't check it a person by the cover.